they were singing Step to Jesus And everything is gonna be alright Oh, the Holy Ghost You could feel And the sisters They would shout for real For they were just having Just having just of love the Father have bestowed upon us. John 3, 16 says, For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son that whosoever believeth in him shall not perish but have everlasting life. Behold what manner of love that the Father have bestowed upon us. I want to talk this morning about love under new management. Love under new management. There was a song, and I, I preached it some years ago. Mickey Howard, some of y'all know. Uh, recording artist, she put out a song some years ago that I'm in love on the new management. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, so, some of y'all act like y'all don't know who I'm talking about. Y'all, y'all probably know more about Mickey Howard than y'all know about James Cleveland. <laughs> but she put out a hit tune that says, "I'm in love." on the new management. She was trying to let her old ex know that he was getting a, 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 a pink slip, whatever you want to call it, <laughs> that she didn't no longer need his services any longer. And you know, when I think about it, I, 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 I used to remember some of the words was in a song. Uh, for so long, the song seemed to imply, Reese, that she had been in prison by this old manager. And, and, and she seemed to just in a song when she, when she let the new manager take over, Sister Bertha. I know some words she said, a new world of happiness. <laughs> Can't, you know, uh, but when I think about it, all of us that are born into this world, Amen. somebody going to manage your life. Amen. There, are, there are two entities. Either you're going to allow God to manage your life, or you're going to allow Satan to manage your affairs. And it, it, it don't seem to be that there's, and believe me, they are as different as night and day. Satan, we know, ain't about nothing, never have been about nothing, and never will be about nothing. And he will use you until he use you up. Oh, oh how sad it is now sometimes to see some of the folk that grew up with me, Charles, that, that traveled the fast lane. Some of them look old enough to be my granddaddy now. And they come up to me and say, hey, Leon, I said, who are you? The fast lane will kill you dead. Yeah. The fast lane. But, but a lot of us love, that's why a lot of us, it don't surprise me. Y'all, y'all, y'all see it in our everyday life. Sometimes we see a nice person. It can be a male or a female, y'all, and they get hooked up with the most low down, no good person that you could ever imagine. And for one, by how in the world did he get hooked up with her? Or did she get hooked up with him? Because sometimes. 
Anything good, the devil going to try to corrupt it. Amen. Did y'all hear what I said? Amen. Anything good, the devil is going to try to corrupt it. I, I, I know. Now somebody, well, well he, he don't, you know, that, that's why he comes to church. Well, that's why he hitchhiked his way to church because he's not interested in no folk out of the world. He already got them wrapped around his finger. But he's interested in those that's trying to make a difference in their life and trying to help change others' lives. If he can mess you up, that, that's what it, And he's a sweet talker, y'all. He, he, he's a sweet, that's why you ought not listen to the devil. You, 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 that, that's why the Bible says spiritual things are spiritually discerned. You ought to know who, 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 who's putting the thoughts in your mind. Yeah. Hey, 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 man, I, I used to have a friend, thought he was a player, child. And he used, he, used, he used to have a saying. He said, she stopped long enough to listen. <laughs> she mine. <laughs> and that's what the devil figures. With a lot of us, if you stop long enough to listen, you ain't strong enough yet. That, that's why I tell folks, stop talking about you so strong and stop flirting with temptation. All right, all right. Stop flirting, you ain't that strong. And a lot of us, a lot, lot of us, a lot of us, that, that's why. The Bible said, does say this, there is no temptation given to man where God do not provide a way of escape. The problem is a lot of us don't want to escape. Matter of fact, instead of running another way, we run into it. No, I, I wonder how can the devil, I, I, I just wonder, I, 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 it makes me mad, I wonder how can the devil pull so many of y'all? You know, that's the term they used to have. Yeah, yeah, you know, you, we used to go to the club, and, and the guys, you said, I pulled me one. Like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, y'all yeah, know that's the term that you, we used to use. I wonder sometimes how it is that the devil can walk up in here and pull so many of y'all. <laughs> and some of, you could pro some of you say you're married to the Lord. Good God Almighty. Some of you say you belong to God, but you're letting the devil pull you. Right. Oh. Right. How is it? How, how is it? And none of y'all talk about you don't like because you, if you didn't like him, you wouldn't listen to him. You know. Yes, Baby, I don't like him. Why are you talking on the phone to him all the time? Why every time I look up, you're texting him, and he's texting you. You need to tell that to somebody who might believe it. Hello? They always told me if it walked like a duck, <laughs> if it quack like a duck, look like a duck, no doubt it is. And then, now watch this. If the devil can't pull you, and you got a spouse, what do you do? He'll pull your spouse. What do you do when he pull them? He, he, what do he do? He's, he's uh-huh. Oh, so-and-so cheating on you. <laughs> He'll put the thought in your head. And there's some folk that get crazy jealous. Hello? Let me tell y'all something about jealousy. Jealousy ain't no good for nobody. You, you know, I, I, I can talk about me. I don't know about y'all. Some of y'all y'all might not admit it, but y'all been there too. But I remember when I, before I met Sister Taylor, I had a girlfriend. I liked her. I really did. And somebody put the thought in my head that my girlfriend was seeing somebody else. And I said, they said, and, and, and I said, and I, I learned this a long time ago. And they, they, they say, well, you know, well, no doubt she's the same place she was with you. Put the thought there, so I started riding. 
And guess what? She was the same place <laughs> that she with me. And I learned then, never go looking for nothing that you don't want to find. Did y'all hear what I said? Never go looking for something that you don't want to find. Jealousy is dangerous. And Satan, if he can't pull one of you, he'll try to infiltrate your partner with jealousy. I mean, they do it with members and pastors too, you know. The, you know, uh, uh, members try to make one another jealous of each other. This jealousy is of the devil. Did y'all hear what I said? Yeah. But, 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 but now, if you are dealing with this old manager, and Satan is the old manager. If you, for those of you who've been born again, Satan is your old manager because we all are born, what? Sinners. So he got the job automatically by, you know, we don't have to teach our children to do wrong. We have to teach them to do what's right. And only Christ can help them do what's right. But I, I really want to get to the, the bottom line is, young men, y'all accepted Christ. That means you really became a new a creature. In other words, you shouldn't be, if you've been lying to your daddy and mama, that means because you're a new creature in Christ, that means you, got on, you took on a new nature. You took on God's nature. So therefore, you ought not be lying no more. Right. See, it, it's more than about just getting in the water, right. getting dipped under. You, it, that's, Christianity is a change from what's on the inside. Right. And see, a lot of us, a lot, lot of us do like this little project I got going now. You know, uh, I brought this 95 Chevrolet truck a few weeks ago. And it, didn't, it looked like crap. It really did. I knew it. Matter of fact, when I got, I asked her to take the frame one of the pieces because I got rid of it. So she got to ride back to me. She just, she, now she know not to say nothing, but she just looked at me. <laughs> like, I can't believe. <laughs> you, you, you understand? Like, I, I really just can't believe. He really did it. Because the truth of the matter, what, what I traded, both of what I traded was running better than what I got. But see, what I saw was potential. And you ought to be glad that God looked at potential. Because for some of you, the way you are right now, he will spit you out of the face. But thank God that he looks at what you can become. But it's going to take some, some work. The, the first thing I had to do was get it, get it running mechanically right. Hello? That, that's why being saved, it starts on, on the inside. God has this change, created me. A clean heart, renew within me. The right spirit. Sometimes you got to have the right heart and the right kind of spirit in you. Listen, Jesus Christ will and can make a difference in every one of our lives. If we will allow him to do so. That's why coming to church ought to make a difference in your life. I, I, I mean, the Bible says, behold, what manner of love that the Father has bestowed on, upon us that we should be called the sons of God. You know what? It was, it's a powerful love. How many know God is what? God is love. And behold what manner of love. Listen, you know, God is love. What that says to me about God's love, and let, let, that's something else, let me tell you, that, that, that a couple of words even coming up I did not play with. One was friend, and the other was love. Yeah. I heard my mom say, you know, when John used to 
tell the girl, I love you, baby. You try to get what you know what I mean? Uh uh. I didn't I didn't play that because love and friendship are important to me. I never tell you I love you unless I mean it. I'll never tell you I'm your friend unless I mean it. Now that's me. I don't know what you know. Now y'all y'all you know I hear y'all talking about oh I got I got a lot of friends. Be for real. If you got one or two friends, you ought to thank God for them. The, the reason I value those two so highly is because, first of all, the Bible said God is love. love. The next thing, great friendship is so bad. Jesus said, greater love have no man than this, that he will lay down his life for his friend. So I think, and, and they, they kind of intertwine. You, 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 if you got a real friend, it's love. In other words, it ain't no limit to what you will do for a real friend. It was no limit to what God did for us. He said, greater love have no man than this, that he lay down his life for his friend. So when it comes to friend and love, I don't play with those words. Now, behold, what kind of love? Do you not know? I told you God look at our potential. Do you not know God got a fixed attitude about you? He got a fixed attitude. In other words, God loves us in spite of us. That, that's, that, that's why his love is un. Conditional love. It, 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 in other words, when they're saying about he looked beyond my faults and saw my needs, it's because his love is unconditional. It's unconditional. In other words, it ain't because of what I do, but it, it's in spite of who I am. In other words, yes, God love all of us messed up folks. He got a fixed attitude about it. You can't change his mind. I can't change his mind. He loves you and ain't nothing you can do about it. He, he loves you. It, it's unconditional. It's unconditional. And I know you've been torn. I know y'all been flirting with the devil. Hello. <laughs> I know you've been talking to her late at night in, in the corners of your, when you all think you all by yourself. And, and stop talking about didn't nobody see you. Just say you didn't see nobody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I know you've been playing with, and let me tell you something. You can rest sure what's done in the dark. It will come. That's why I tell you, don't worry about it. Folk, you can come up here and smile in my face. Give time, time. And the real you going to show up, show up. The real you. you ain't got, that's why when folks trying to pretend like they one thing, when in reality they something else, don't worry, just give time, time. The real you will come to surface. Because one thing you can do, you can run from a lot of them. Can't run from yourself. And what's done in the <laughs> But behold, what matter? A law that he has bestowed upon us, that he still even considers us and calls us his children. Yeah. We ain't been nothing but a bunch of adulterers and homeowners. Right. Y'all ain't hearing me this morning. We cheated on God, y'all. Anytime you sin, you're stepping out. <laughs> yeah, on God. And God, I, 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 I know, good God of mine, I've been in love, but I ain't crazy. You keep on stepping out if you want to. They used to have a song my little niece used to like to hear. It was an old song. 
You keep stepping out on me, I'm gonna tell you, hit the road, Jack. And don't you come back no more, no more, no. Hit the road, Jack. But ain't y'all glad that God ain't told us to hit the road, Jack? Behold what manner of love that the, he has bestowed upon us and why, good God Almighty, that we can be called the children of God. God love, thank God, thank God, thank God, I'm in love on the new man. Because you see the devil only, he only play with you while you, while you, while you work in his agenda. When you get where the devil can't use you, he'll, he'll drop you. <laughs> a lot of y'all, it's sad to say you wait till you get old. The devil can use you up. <laughs> yeah, you can gave all your time. You can done all the dirt you thought you were big enough to do. Yeah, you, 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 you not only was, was, was messing up with the devil, but you, were, you, you was also coating his demons. <laughs> yeah, and now he can ditch you. Yes, he has. He ain't got nothing for you. You, you, you know the, the folk you used to hang out with now, they ain't even got time for you. The folk you used to get high with, they ain't got time for you no more. But now, here you go. That's why a lot of folks talking about, you, now it's true for some folk, I came to Jesus just there. You right? Everything else had ditched you and dumped you. And here you come to Jesus, but thank God he got a fixed attitude. Thank God that, that no matter how low I sank in Taisha, that God love, he still loves me. I can't understand it because I told you just a few minutes ago, I'd have told some of you to hit the road, Jack. But thank God that God ain't told us to hit the road, Jack. He, he looks at it. He loves us. Fixed attitude. You can't change it. And, and that's why we need to stop trying to make God hate folk we don't like. God got a fixed attitude. He loves us in spite of us. God's love. A God pay. Unconditional. In other words, I don't know hardly nobody but God that has unconditional love. Hello? I, I, I think Mother's Day coming up next Sunday. I think the closest thing we might can find to it is some mother's love. Some mothers will go along with anything. They love their children. Thank God my, my mom gone on home, but God knows she loved that baby brother of mine. I wanted to kill him sometimes, Sister Mason, but <laughs> she loved that baby brother. <laughs> In spite of all the stuff he did, she still loved him. Sometimes mothers love like that toward their children. But you know what? Even greater than a mother's love is God's love. Because sometimes mothers will ditch you and tell you to hit the road, Jack. But when mom, David said, when my mother and my father forsake me, then will the Lord take me. That, 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 that's the word. When, when you know the word, mother and father can forsake you. But God's word, God will always, his love stands sure. Now, he loves you, but you got to change some things. Uh, back to that, back to, a lot, and a lot of us try to, to, to fix ourselves up, and we make a big mess. Like, like back to that truck store I was telling you about, I, I called myself going to camouflage. I, bought, I went and brought me some camouflage paint, some stencils, Junior, and I started, I didn't, it can't make it look no worse than it is. 
So I started just putting stuff on. I looked at it and said, mm. And thank God that he was looking out for me when I wasn't looking out for me. <laughs> and it just happened. You know, I, I, I do a lot of stuff on eBay, and uh, I had made a ridiculous low off on some rap. And, and the guy accepted, I guess God feels sorry for him. <laughs> so he accepted my low offer, but I already done put all this paint and stuff on. I mean, I caked it up good, man. I, you know, I, I spray that stencil, put four or five of them weeds on there, spray it thick, then I turn it over, turn all the spray over spray, and just flop it on the hood. <laughs> you can't mess up, kind of, I mean, paint was caked up that thick on the hood. And then it dawned on me, before I can put the rep, I got to get all that <laughs> mess up. So I spent two or three days sanding, stripping. <laughs> and sometimes, listen to me, listen to me, the point is this. Some of us trying to camouflage our life. And ain't doing nothing but getting caked up and messed up. What you need to do is let the Lord do a good old time stripping. Strip you down. And sometimes God had to strip us down to just who we are. So when you really say, I came to Jesus as I was, sometimes God had to strip you down that that be the absolute truth. I, I had to strip it down. And, and, but, but now remember the first thing I did, I had to get it running right. You got to get your mind, your heart in the right place. Do y'all hear what I said? But now, the good news is, I can see a change coming, y'all. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I can see. It took some hard work, Rambo. But the hard work is going to pay off. And let me tell you something. God has invested in each of us. It's been a hard haul for some of you. But thank God, he got, God knows that his love is going to pay off. <laughs> Because you see, when it's all said and done, can't nobody do us like Jesus. <laughs> yeah, behold, what matter of love, thank God. Thank God. I, I, I remember Mickey Howe was, was, was telling us she didn't want the fellow to sing, I heard it through the grapevine. She said, I'm telling you myself, I'm in love under some new management. I, I don't know who she was talking about, but I thank God that he had a great love of me. Behold, what manner of love that God had for you and I. Yes, how, how great is the love of God so loved, good God Almighty, so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son. Yeah. That whosoever and praise God for the whosoever. Yeah. I, I would have liked to have tell you that, that I got him all by myself but he told me you ain't the only one but whosoever. Yeah. Believe on him shall have everlasting life. Yes, and I thank God today uh, that he's my new manager. Um, I, I thank God today uh, that a long time ago uh, I decided, good God in my head, to make Jesus um, my choice. Um, yes, I thank God today uh, a long time ago um, I decided, yeah, some folk, um, would rather have uh, houses and lands. Uh, some folk, uh, silver or gold, uh, these things they treasure uh, and forget about their soul. But oh, I thank God today. Uh, I decided, I decided uh, to make Jesus my choice. Uh, the road uh, may get rough uh, and the going may get tough, uh, but I decided. I, 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 I decided to make 
Lord, my choice and since I did behold what kind of love he got for me y'all know what kind of love he got he love us so that one Friday they hung him high they stretched him wide he bowed his head in the locks of his shoulder he died I said he died because he loved me and I don't know uh, about y'all they asked a question uh, a long time ago uh, why did Jesus uh, come down from the cross somebody said did the nails keep him there the nails couldn't keep him there but love uh, kept him hanging there love uh, kept him there ain't he alright he died but thank God today Friday, Friday, Friday. Sunday morning Get up Declare all power All power Yeah I don't know what y'all call it But that's love Ain't God alright I'm glad I'm not like Tina Turner Wanna know what's love got to do with it love got everything to do with my salvation yeah behold what kind of love but that ain't even the good part y'all it's the potential that God saw in me and then once I let him take control he let me see it in myself Cause when I look in light of his word, I look at me, I realize I'm getting old, I realize my footsteps getting shorter, but that's all right, because I got his love. Verse 2 said, do not yet appear what we shall be, but one thing I do know, I one of these old days, I'm going to look just like him, y'all, yeah! I know one thing, when he come, I'm going to see him as he is. I'm going to see Jesus, y'all, just as he is. Ain't he all right? Ain't he all right? Ain't he all right? All right! The whole since I'm a child of God, it don't appear what I shall be. But one thing I know, when he appears, I'm going to be just like him. I don't know about y'all, but oh, I really want to see him, y'all. Really want to look on his face. Ain't he all right? Ain't he all Thank God for his love. Yes. Jesus loved me. Ain't you glad? Ain't you glad about it? The door is open. Because he loved me so, y'all. I'm going to keep on holding on. I ain't going to let go. They said I wouldn't make it. They said... I wouldn't be here today they said he'll never amount to be anything but I'm glad to say that I'm still on my way and I I've been growing more and more each day listen there were many that started out with me but right now right now they all have gone astray but y'all know what i'm still i'm still holding on yes i'm still 
still holding on praise God I'm still I'm still holding on to to his hand I, I gotta say it again this song is my personal testimony of what God have done they said I wouldn't make it they said I wouldn't be here today they said you know what oh Leon he gonna never be anything listen but I'm glad to say the door is open that I'm still on my way and God knows I've been growing I've been growing more and more each day there were many started out with me but right now right now right now they all have gone astray but thank God today I'm still I'm still holding on yes I'm still I'm still holding on praise God I'm still I'm still holding on to to his hand listen I don't know about y'all but my road been rough but you know in every situation God always brought me through You see, when I was young, I gave God my hand. I asked the Lord, Jesus, would you please lead me all the way? I don't know about y'all. My road, it's been rough. My going, been tough. But y'all know what? I ain't going nowhere, no, no. I'm out here, I'm out here to stay. I don't know about y'all. I've been lied on. I've been criticized so many nights, Lord. I had to wipe, I found myself wiping tears from my eyes. But that's all right, I'm still. I'm still holding on Yes, I'm still I'm still holding on The door shut open Praise God, I'm still I'm still holding on To, to his head and I don't care if the whole world know about it. Church, listen. And I'm still. Oh, yes I am. I'm still part. I'm still part of God's holy plan. Church, and I'm still. Oh, yes, I am. I know I'm bound. I'm bound for the promised land, church. And I'll never, I, oh, of his hand. God knows I'm still holding on, y'all, church. And I'm still Oh yes I am I'm still part I'm still part Of God's master plan Church And, and I'm still Oh yes I 
yes I am I know I'm bound I'm bound for the promised land church and and I'll never I'll never never let go of his hand no 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 I'll never 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 let go I ain't gonna turn it to loose no 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 church I'll never 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 let go I ain't gonna turn loose of God's hand 